Good afternoon, my dudes. Welcome to the channel. I'm Quitty Bags, and welcome back to the channel. So today, my dudes, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make pressure plate activated sticky piston doors. So these are a lot better than your average, you know, your average iron doors, as you guys can see. Um, so we're going to be doing two different models here. We're going to be doing a two by three, and we're also going to be doing a little guy over here, a two by two. Now these, uh, these honestly look awesome compared to like, you know, iron doors or, you know, just wooden doors. And it can uh, add a lot of characteristic to your home or whatever you want to put it on. So my dudes, let's get started. Now before we do, let's see if we can smash a 500 like goal. Let's see if that's possible. 500 likes, my dudes. And also, if you are new to the channel and you want to become one of the dudes, make sure to smash that sub button right now. And don't forget to hit that little notification bell so you guys don't miss any Minecraft tutorials or any other videos on this channel. So, my dudes, let's get started. So, as you can see how these work, um, they are pressure plate activated. And on the inside here, we actually have sticky pistons ran with redstone underneath. And uh, they run up the side and basically open the doors. So I'm going to show you guys how to make them. Now, before I do, I'm going to go over what you guys will require to make these. Now, both of these are basically the same for the actual material list, except for, obviously, the 2 by 3 one requires two extra sticky pistons. All right, so what we're going to need here, we're only going to need, for the 3 by 3 build, we're only going to need six sticky pistons, a handful of redstone, um, two redstone torches, I believe, and basically any brick of your choice to do the lining of it. And then, of course, a pressure plate. Now, it's very, very minimum material, as you guys can see. So, let's get into building these. All right, dudes, let's get started. Now, we're going to make the three by two first. So, let's go ahead and dig our hole. So, we're going to dig a two by three um, hole, well, rectangle here. And uh, it's going to be two deep. And then go on this side and dig two. And then put it like that. And then mirror that side. So, dig two deep. And then dig one deep like that. Now go ahead and fill this hole with redstone all the way up just like this. Now at the backs, well at the sides here, go ahead and place a redstone torch on each side. So now what we're going to do is grab a sticky piston and we're going to aim at the torch and put one there, put one there, and put one there. Now reminder, this is the 3 by 2 door we're doing first. So just like that, my dudes. So as you guys can see, the one, the two bottom pistons are open now. Well, pushed, uh, yeah, I guess open, I'd say. So now all you're going to do is place a block on each side, and that will pick, make the um, second piston open up, and then place a piece of redstone on the top, and that'll make the third piston open up. Now, we're almost done here already. All you got to do is place a floor down, and then grab your pressure plates, put them on each side, and there you guys have it. That is the 2x3 door. Pretty simple so far. I hope I explained that good. All right, let's move on to the 2x2 two two door. All right, let's make the 2x2 two two door now. So what we're going to do here is we're going to dig the same hole, a 2x3 rectangle, and then we're going to dig um, two down there, and then one like that. So three blocks, one, two, three, and then two deep like that. Make sure to leave these ones up. Now what you're going to do is just go ahead and fill this hole with, um, with redstone now. But uh, over here on these blocks, put a redstone torch instead of filling them in. All right, now what you're going to do is go ahead and go over the redstone torch and place a block of your choice, just like this. Now, on top of your block of choice, put a piece of redstone. And now, stack two sticky pistons like this. And we'll go like this. Put a floor in it. And put your pressure plates on each side. And there you have it. Your door is complete. All right, so that's how you make a 2x2 two two piston door and a 2x3 piston door activated by pressure plates. Very, very simple. Very minimum, um, basically very minimum materials that you actually need to make these. So it's really nice to make them. Um, the only thing that's a little bit difficult is to get the uh, sticky piston. Sometimes it's hard to find slimes. But I do have a slime farm on my channel if you want to check through the tutorial list. But thank you so much for watching, my dudes. I very much appreciate it. Hopefully this helps you out, and hopefully you make something cool in the future with this. Thanks for watching. Let's see if we can smash that 100, whoa, 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 I said 500 like goal. And also, if you're new to the channel, make sure to smash that sub button, hit that notification button. And I will see you guys in the next Minecraft tutorial. Peace out, my dudes.